All right, so I just wanted to take some time to first of all say thank you so much for following me along on this journey. Thank you so much for subscribing to my channel and uh, enjoying the content that I'm putting out. Um, if it wasn't for you guys, I wouldn't still be doing this. Um, and we are almost at 4,000 subscribers, which is crazy because literally like a couple months ago, we were at like 100, 200, 500 subscribers, and now we're finally at 4K. So thank you so much. So if you haven't already, go hit that subscribe button and follow along on this awesome journey of North American theme parks and eventually much larger. Um, but let's get right into it. So the first um, thing I wanted to talk about was um, this whole focus on Canadiana theming at Canada's Wonderland and how it plays into this new awesome attraction coming in 2019. Um, it is no hidden secret that Canada's Wonderland is obviously getting a coaster next year in 2019. And a lot of people think it's either going to be a dive coaster or a wing coaster. Um, a lot of um, things have been happening over the last couple days that 100% lead us to believe that this is probably going to be a Canadian themed coaster as well. The park is aggressively going after its Canadian heritage and becoming literally Canada's wonderland. Um, and it is working phenomenally. I am absolutely in love with the theming that Canada's wonderland is getting. And I'm absolutely in love with how it is being portrayed. I, at first, I was a little bit concerned because stereotypes can sometimes come off a little Ugh, really? But they are doing it in such a brilliant way. Look at this. It's absolutely gorgeous. And I cannot wait to see this on the coaster. Um, there are a few things that I have seen on property that lead me to believe that either the teaser campaign is about to start or we are seeing theming for this coaster already in the storage lot. Um, we're gonna, I'm going to discuss that a little bit in this video as you're about to see some of it. And then I want you guys to comment below what kind of theming or storyline do you think that they're going to tell with this Klondike Gold Rush type of coaster that we're going to see in 2019, if it happens to be that. So why don't we get right into it? So here we have more rebar cages and you see a lot of like almost like Canadian lumber. Um, we have what looks like those Canadian style park benches or trees for theming or maybe a teaser. And then above that, you have this weird old boat, um, which would look like to me, that almost seems like maybe it could be part of a teaser campaign. Um, what do you guys think? Do you think this is theming for the new coaster? Or do you think this is a teaser campaign? Um, so above these barrels as well, we have what is called the Timber Kits Lumber right there. And then you can also see those barrels, um, which you're going to, I think, get a closer look at now. Um, yeah, so that to me definitely screams Canadiana and almost like that old pioneer type of theming, uh, like the Klondike Gold Rush. And I have a feeling this might fit in this new area they're going to build on the Timberwolf Path. Um, as you saw in my update yesterday, I definitely think there's some new like restaurants or kind of like shops or theming that's going to be built on that pathway. There is a lot of markers. Um, so I just wanted to finish off this video that um, I think it's no hidden secret that we're definitely going to be seeing some Canadiana theming at the park and I couldn't be more excited. Um, so why don't you guys tell me, are you excited to see more Canadian theming over that Ziz um, rumor that was back in the day? Or did you really want to see that Ziz on this new coaster? Anyways, thanks for watching guys. Have a good one. Bye.